Hi there. My name's Jake, and I've been working on Unblock work for a little while. And while it's not quite out yet, uh, it's getting very close, and so I wanted to give you all a preview on what we have and what it looks like. Now, of course, there are going to be some changes between now and when it releases, uh, but for the most part, we're just working on odds and ends and polish at this point, which means uh, I can actually show you what we have. So let's get started here. We'll jump in. I'm on the sign-in page for Unblock Work right now, and I'll just go ahead and log into my account. And when you log in for the first time, you'll see this exact page, except for this bit where I've already created my first organization. We'll take a look at this, and then I'll even show you the process of making a new one. So in Unblock Work, all of your stuff is grouped into organizations, and these are for a company, for your group of friends, or uh, anybody that you need to organize stuff with, uh, or even for yourself if you just want a personal organization to keep track of vacations or any chores or any routines that you're doing. You can totally do that. Here I have an organization, and I'm just going to open it up. And in each organization, we have multiple projects that you can track your work in, whatever that work may be. So each project gets its own little tools and data that uh, you can keep track of. So in my organization here, I have one project so far. I'm going to open that up, and you'll see I have some posts and some to-dos. So uh, we'll start with our posts. Our posts let us uh, just, well, make posts in a little message board, which is super useful for taking notes or for discussion with other people. If you want to um, post a short or a long uh, message about like, hey, I have this project that I'm doing and I have these uh, thoughts about it, you can come in and communicate with some other people on this project uh, to get it all worked out. Or if you want to just use it for taking notes, that's great too. We also have to-dos in our project, so I can come over to to-dos, hit view, and we'll see I have multiple to-do lists and I can tick stuff off, untick stuff, and I can create new to-dos and, and also new lists. Um, I can even drill into an individual list here and just focus on these ones, which I find really useful. Uh, when I'm working on stuff, I'll load up one to-do list and open this up and throw the window on the side of my screen to just chug through each one. All right, so that's kind of the basics of Unblock Work. We have organizations, and each organization has projects. And those projects contain posts and to-dos, so you can organize your work into these little chunks. So why don't I show you how to make a new organization with Unblock Work? Some of this stuff might change, but for the most part, I think it's going to be the same when we release it. So I'll hit, uh, I'll go back to organizations here. I'll hit new organization. I'll say my new org. I'll hit create and that'll send me over to the billing. Uh, so I'm just going to take care of this. Once you're finished filling out your payment information, we'll head back over to Unblock Work, and yay, we can go ahead and check out our org. So of course, my organization doesn't have any projects yet. Let's change that. We'll say, okay, my cool project. And in here, we have our posts and to-dos, just like I showed you before. You'll notice uh, it looks a little bit different. We don't have any posts and to-dos yet, so I'm going to go ahead and make a post. Say, um, my first post. Um, I should do something cool with this project. All right. And if I go back here, our post screen now shows it. And back on my project, you'll notice these little entries that show up are the latest in the posts or to-dos. We'll also see that in a moment. Um, the latest entries available, and you can actually click on these directly to jump straight to the latest work in your project, which is very helpful being able to get back to whatever you were doing. So we'll go back and to-dos. Let's, let's go ahead and try and create some to-do lists. So um, I have some cool stuff because this is a cool project. Um, something cool and something else cool. Oh shoot, I forgot to add exclamation points. Let's go ahead and update these. Perfect. We'll tick off the ones that are done already. 
and I can continue adding new lists. Um, I can work off of these to-do lists in this main to-dos page. Uh, so I can add new to-dos, or I can also click into the actual to-do list itself and work on it here. Another to-do. And if I don't like a to-do, I can delete it. So that's the basics of unblock work here. We have our organizations with projects and posts and to-dos. You can invite people to your organization. You can add them to projects so that way specific people are on specific projects and they can work together. Um, I'm super excited to be uh, releasing this soon and I hope that you're all as excited as I am to try it out. Um, I spent a while figuring out what it was that I really wanted in a tool because I didn't want something complicated. It didn't need a bunch of features. I just wanted something focused that got out of my way and let me keep track of my work without uh, kind of slowing things down with all of the bloat and fluff that you might find in other solutions. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're excited for Unlock Work when it releases. And I'll see you when it does.